everyone to our first episode on the new Minecraft server we're going to be playing on. It is called Puck's Cove. That's right, we're on an island. We're not in an island per se right now, but that's okay. We'll be heading back there. That's going to be our community area. We've Chauncey and I have wandered off a, a few few blocks and set up where we'd sort of like to do our, our base for the season. You're going to get a nice view of that space there. I plan on doing a lot with it as well as doing some stuff right underneath of us. Now, if you're watching, you can see I've got a new skin on. I'm a castaway. This is actually a throwback to what I believe was the Pucket of Wagon uh, server, which was two seasons ago. And uh, that's the first one that I played. Switched the skin back. And I need to get KOK on the back still. He's got long hair and a beard. Anyway, um, it throw back to that. This is going to be our third season on this server, which is pretty cool. We actually were able to document a lot of uh, what we did on the last server and looking to do it on this one from the beginning, which is pretty cool, uh, I must say. We've done a bit of work already so far. Uh, we are at how many? Almost three hours in. I figured I would skip all that boring boring stuff and uh sort of give you a little bit of a, a recap of the the start of this server and uh just just a quick one because i mean you guys have all seen that kind of stuff before it's uh it's all pretty well the same you go mine and you have a, a meeting which there's some interesting information from that as well as uh, we do do a little bit of caving. We'll have a look at a couple snippets. I didn't record everything because yeah, you've seen all that before. But uh, let's go and take a quick look at that. And then uh, I'll show you what we've been working on at our base, which is right in front of us. So welcome to the new server. I Unfortunately, I can't remember what the uh, name was actually decided Pucks upon. Pucks Cove! It's Pucks Cove! Pucks Cove. Pucks Cove. So welcome oh, to Pucks Cove. Oh, so the island, the island you are now standing on, will henceforth be known as Spawn Island. I know it's very unimaginative, but we will change that when we actually start doing builds. This island is the temporary home for the server for the time being. Um, we are going to allow uh, players to build homes here for a short period of time, but this will become the center of the server. This will be where everybody spawns anew. This is where everybody will come to to do uh, group meetings. Uh, and this is also where the beginning of the commerce district is gonna start. Um, after a time, the island will no longer be a temporary or a player residence uh, build island. Uh, all personal bases or, or builds will be outside of a 100 block radius of this center altar with some areas being reserved by the admins, which is uh, Hank the Tank, Casey Moon, and myself for the time being. Um, the admins will designate uh, community zones, commercial districts, amusement zones, and other fun stuff like that. Everywhere else is basically free for the taking. We need to go find food before we start. First kill! <laughs> I'm winning! Okay, and... Mm -hmm. Oh man, this place is so dangerous! <laughs> <laughs> but how do you like having an island to start? Ah, uh, <laughs> it's good and bad at the same time right now. It doesn't provide a lot of options for running away. No, no. it sure well, there's, doesn't. There's a, where is everyone? There is a main island. Oh, and there island. I go. It's not far. Which side of this island is it? <laughs> where is it? It is this way. <laughs> Respawn in the top of the game itself is telling me just give up. No, oh. we found a ravine. You, we found a ravine too. Oh, somebody's gonna be shiny. You're not the only one, I hear that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and survey says yes. there seems to be a running theme here. Yes. Yes, there is. Careful, man. Man, just listening to you two is giving me anxiety. It's like, oh my god, don't die! <laughs> We're not gonna die. We're experienced professionals. 
<laughs> oh, we need to explore around here for a bit. Yep. Oh, give me some iron. I'll take this. We almost got a full stack of redstone blocks. Nice. Kind of like this hill. Yeah. It's pretty darn nice. I could work with this. Me too. I wish there was a natural cave right entrance right here, but... You can make one. Oh, yeah. Just jumping up it. Maybe there's something beautiful on the other side. Ah, uh, you know, I think it one. is. The hills are alive with the sound of music. I think we should set up house here, man. Sounds good to me. Oh, yes, that's beautiful. Yeah. Wait, I want to see what this face it looks like. It's pretty Ooh. flat. Very flat, but it can do well with a nice cave entrance right here, kind of partially angled. Mm -hmm. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm not sure exactly what came through for that. It uh, Oh, it's raining all the time already on the server, like every single day. It uh, We've actually got uh, Grumpy Grizz, Casey Moon, Rosa Driz, and myself on at the moment. It, uh, we actually had, earlier today, we had the closure of the, the Flask server. We had more people that wanted to play than the server would allow. It wanted us to have uh, 10 or less was the maximum. Ooh. That hurts. That uh, really oh hurts. Finger's not typing good there. Crazy. But uh, yeah, it. Uh, I hope that there was some some good stuff there. But uh, we're here at our base. It's uh, time to actually. What should we do first? Let's collect our our seeds here. We're getting uh, a started. We got a decent start on the uh, for a food farm, which is gonna be lamb here early on. We'll uh, eventually proceed to cows at one point or another. But uh, that time's not right now because we got so many lamb. It uh, we're we're gonna actually corral a bunch here in a, a little bit while I'm not with you guys because you guys have all done that before. But uh, yeah, we uh, we're off to a great start. We uh, we have all of the sugar cane. We can make a full enchant station, no problem right now. It uh, I've also made oh. A little bit of a fish farm we went through one fishing rod and this is what we got here which was not very great we got this rod as well so what I kind of want to do is collect here we go oh gosh she's having some serious troubles she's having some real serious troubles that sucks what I wanted to do was sort of uh, get enough things together so that we could make a enchanting table and uh, it's not looking like we're gonna get a decent rod oops out of that little fish farm so I want to do an enchant on one of those and a 30 leveler and we're almost there we're, we're really really close we're definitely gonna have enough reeds we've made this way too big but that's okay. You know what? That's really loud, isn't it? That's loud for me. Let me uh, just do a whoops, a quick little a sound adjustment. Let's just knock the whole thing down for now. Holy smokes, that was loud. But yeah, we got more than enough sugar cane to get it to be complete. And what I need to do next, I need to actually go down and find some lava. We need to go down into the caves. And when we find some lava, we need some obsidian. So first things is first. Let's just put these away. We need to make a, a diamond pick. And Chauncey and I, we have found a lot of diamonds already. Chauncey yeah, had some really good uh, luck or intuition, whatever you want to call it, into being able to find us a, a whole bunch of... Oh, I already had sticks. Shoot. A whole bunch of diamonds and uh, it was really really nice 
um, to not really have to worry about that right off the bat because you just you always want to get it going and you want to have a, a strong start and that's exactly what we did mine at the beginning we uh, were sort of left uh, very shortly with a very much time to be able to protect ourselves get some food people were dying all over the place it was uh it was a pretty chaotic start but uh it was a ton of fun i uh i wouldn't have traded it oh also got this i got pasty special tools these are the first one two three four five six seven different items that uh, are tools that were created by me it's my my first set of wooden tools and my first set of stone tools and then my first uh, iron pick still got the first iron shovel still got the first uh, iron axe and the first iron sword right here so i'm hoping to uh, hold on to those and uh, display them somewhere because those are interesting artifacts what we should actually do is place down the date i think we got the date at the the beginning there as well but we got uh oh, june june 18th let's just leave it june 18th we'll we'll remember what the year is and uh, just display those somewhere at some point so uh yeah pretty cool but anyway uh super excited to be on here yeah like could not be any more thrilled now it's been a long time coming and uh that's not the end of the world and uh that's okay i know raven he's put in a lot of work to get the server up and running and uh, i'm just grateful that uh it's finally come to fruition and we can finally play on here i know everyone's pretty excited it's uh a first time it's ever happened where everyone's been playing and we didn't have enough slots for everyone to be on so i'm excited to see the activity over the uh the coming weeks here and uh hope to see everybody on and playing i can't wait to get started on the community area maybe i can uh talk just a little bit about that yeah we got another thunderstorm imagine that shocking news let's get these out of the way oh this is a scary place there's a big tunnel under here but yeah i want to talk a little bit about plans for the community area it uh, i was talking with raving today and uh I know originally I wanted to put in like a little place where people could sleep at night because uh, that's what I did on the last server and it is always necessary to have when you're in town because everyone's got to sleep. So I'm definitely going to put one of those in. As far as what's next, it's uh, it's definitely going to be, and probably should be incorporated into it. It's just sort of a, a meeting house because raving i was talking with him today and he did not want to create it for this server and we were talking and he said you're uh you're a good builder or something like that and he was wondering if i could do the uh the meeting house for this server i felt very honored flattered and uh i can't wait to get started on it dead end rats um, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to find ourselves some um, obsidian and uh, then we're going to create a, because we got 30 levels, we're going to create a uh, enchanting station and uh, we'll see where that takes us for the night. And uh, yeah, right, guys, I'm going to go do that and uh, I'll be back with you shortly. Well, we're back in the world, and I've finally gotten the blocks we needed. We've got enough to do an enchant, but what I wanted to do quickly, just here to start, and this is probably not the best place for it, but that's okay. I wanted to do just a quick look into the, whoops, that's not where that goes, into the, the nether here, and uh, whoops, there we go. And there we go and uh, get ourselves up to a like a 33 or something like that for our level so we can do a couple of enchants just in case we don't get them when we want maybe we can do this pick 
as well but i want to just collect a little bit of nether quartz and i wanted to see <gasps> we spawned on a freaking fortress are you kidding me oh get lost yeah it, get him for turn fire got the achievement challenge accepted what a start into the nether oh god okay did that last guy leave us alone oh yes oh there you are oh that was a close one let's see if we can get him oh he's so far away shoot that bat oh gosh we're on fire oh man Okay, I think we are officially the leaders in uh, gas kills. Wow. This is a great place to be. I can't believe that. That's, uh, that's a pretty wild place to start. We don't have to go looking anywhere. We just got one right by us. And that means we're going to be able to do a little bit more convenient nether things here, I want to say. Which is pretty darn sweet. Now, this way here of collecting uh, XP in the start, this is the way I normally do it. And we normally got to grind a few more levels to get to this part. So this is a, a nice way to start with, uh, we ended up doing all of the collection of all of our valuables. Chauncey let me do that as he sort of dug and determined where we were going. But... Uh, that allowed me to get a lot of experience really quick. And I've done a little bit of actual farming on that fishing farm, which we talked about earlier. I haven't done any since. It's mostly been exploring the caves around uh, below us. And we actually found a uh, mine shaft, which was pretty damn sweet. So I explored that for a little bit. Didn't go like crazy. I wanted to leave a little bit of the exploring with uh, Ashanti because that's, that's a lot of fun. We got enough materials for now. To really get us going um which is uh, a sweet we're off to a really good start casey moon is the the last one left standing along with myself tonight and i think a large part of that is due to the fact that we don't gotta work in the morning and there we go okay let's head back but yeah we're off to a really good start really happy with the area that we've uh, started in we're gonna be able to do uh, what some of my plans are for the season which is gonna be actually really really nice oh we're out of uh, shoot this could be bad actually we're out of arrows well we took out that gas for the last arrow which is pretty cool there we go we're gonna have to protect that and let's grab some food. We're actually going to have to start worrying about food here in just a little bit. But let's uh, let's grab ourselves all of our sugar cane. We will make ourselves a bookcase. And I think you need like two and a half stacks. We'll grab all those. You know what we don't have? We don't have books. Or leather. We don't have leather. Oh, shoot. I'm going to have to come back with you when I have enough leather. I'll be back. Well, I'm, uh, I'm out in the world, and I'm traveling along. We're done decently so far. I found one village. Ooh, look at that bunny. And uh, we got ourselves some books. We got ourselves some books, which is good, so we got a good start. But I've just come across this desert, and I uh, happened to stumble upon a temple. We're about, I think, 1,500 blocks out from uh, where our actual base is. And uh, I'm hoping that we get something cool in here. So I wanted to uh, bring you guys back sort of about the halfway mark of this journey. I think the daylight timer is going really quick. No, time's just passing very fast is the problem. I got to get this back and uh, started for the night. But uh, I'm running out of time. It's uh, getting very late. I don't want to speak too loud. I think everyone in the house that I'm at is sleeping. 
Wow, this is a cool temple. I bet you if we dig in, where is it? Right here? We'll get in. But yeah, I don't want to speak too loud because everyone in my home is, I'm pretty sure, is asleep. So I don't want to get too loud and uh, crazy or anything like that. Oh, we need those sticks now. Shoot, let's just go like this. Grab ourselves a few torches. And uh, we need to dump some stuff is what we need to do. And we actually, we need to go down here first. Pretty sure before anything spawns. Yeah. Okay, moment of excitement. Okay, let's get these out. Um, we'll collect them. Let's get rid of this one here. Uh, we'll get rid of those. Okay, we got the TNT, which is exactly what we want. Let's get rid of... Oh, God, I guess let's get rid of the flowers. Ah, oh, we need to get out of here. Let's get rid of that. We'll get rid of these two. We'll get rid of the... This? The beef, I guess we can get rid of. And those. And I think we can pillar ourselves out of here, no problem. Okay. Let's, uh, let's see what we got. Oh, some light. Okay, gunpowder. That's good. Well, I guess we'll have the bones. We'll see if we can keep that armor or not. It's not looking good. We don't need those. Golden apple, golden apple, golden apple. And no book. Shoot, but four golden apples and a bunch of bones. Okay, let's get ourselves out of here. Shoot. That was unfortunate. Um, but I'm going to keep exploring. And hopefully we find something shortly and we can make our way back and enchant for the night. Because I'm getting tired. It's getting late. I don't normally play this late. And I've got to be up early in the morning. So uh, I'm just going to keep going. And hope that we find uh, what we need for books. And then head back to home and chant. And I'll see you there. Well, we made it back all the way to our base. Of course, Casey Moon has just been dying up a storm to that. I don't know how many times she's accidentally passed away tonight. The latest one was falling too high, which really sucks. Feel bad for her, but she's doing okay. She's really doing okay. She's having fun somewhere. I'm sure of it. Uh, guess you can go there. Grab these guys. I have what i believe to be enough i'm really hoping that this is enough for us to actually complete our enchanting station we'll get some enchants let's get that started right now okay here we go i need these guys so we need paper and let's actually build it uh let's go like that Let's build it this way. Can we build a bookshelf in here? They don't have it yet. That's unfortunate. Okay, so let's make a... Oh, well, actually... We need to give ourselves a lot of these. That allows us to make a bookshelf. And we can do 21. Uh, I don't think that that is enough. Uh, oh, and we do actually need to make a few books. So let's just go like this. We're going to use them anyway. And we need glass. Oh, we need glass. Um, I'm pretty sure we need glass for the enchanting table. I can't quite remember what we need for the enchanting table. Let's see here. Uh, we need these to be smelted. Can we make it from this? We cannot. So I know we need obsidian. We need diamonds. I think we need one diamond for that. Ah, we can make the enchanting table. Ah, this new crafting system is perfect for someone like me who really doesn't know all of the recipes, not everything. Okay, so let's go over here. We're going to set up some enchanting. And let's see. So we got one, two, three 
four. And go here. Ooh, and actually, I don't think we want the ones in the corners. Let's uh, pick that up just in case. We can remake that bookshelf. That's not the end of the world. And let's put in a light and this guy on top. And what do we got for enchants? Level 30. Perfect. Okay, let's go and grab ourselves a brand new fish rod. Uh, what do we got the string? It will be in here. Yes, okay. Two of those. We'll need some sticks. Let's actually clean some of this stuff out. I know these guys can go here. Uh, let's put this food away. Was there any more food? I don't see any. We got some quartz. We got some more drops of things. Our first sword we can drop off here. It's ran its course. Uh, we got pumpkins. Paper, I guess we can put in there. The bones go in there. Oh, we needed these two. Whoops. And then we need the lapis. We'll get two enchants here. Okay. Some sticks. And we'll make a fish rod. And let's see what we got. Ooh, this is exciting. Our very first two enchants of the season on episode one let's see unbreaking unbreaking i kind of want the unbreaking for now it's just an unbreaking three hopefully we get something else better with that efficiency four let's make another fish rod just to see i mean i would i would want one with uh luck at the sea on it uh, that would be really beneficial whoops for myself as I'm about to go to bed for the night so let's grab that and let's see what it is unbreaking three I think I'd rather have the pick just efficiency four. well that's not the end of the world okay but I think that's gonna do it for this episode guys I, uh, I want to thank you so much for watching. I'm going to do a little harvest here to gather up these final materials for the night. We'll set up a little bit more on the, the fish farm uh, for the chess. And I'm going to call it a night. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And uh, we'll see you next time.